So here we have it, Dublin Mayo, second part of the story. Come on, you boys in blue! For me, I suppose, could be Mayo, but I have a sneaky feeling that Dublin could get this one. I don't think Dublin will play as poorly as they did the last day. Let's see what happens. Mayo to win by three. Tom Parsons to be man of the match, and we're taking Sam home. Yeah! For me, it's going to be a hard one to call. I think it's going to be really, really close, but it has to be Dublin by two. For me, two of the key clashes today will obviously be Lee Keegan and Dermot Connolly. They had an epic battle the last day, a lot of focus on them, and it'll be interesting to see how that goes today. Another one I'll be keeping an eye on is Aidan Shea and Philly McMahon. I think Aidan Shea needs to perform for Mayo to win this. And Philly McMahon has had his card for the last couple of years, so that'll be interesting as well. Uh, well, it was a tough battle again, a very, very close game. I think the difference in the game was that Dublin scoring forwards uh, compared to Mayo. I think Mayo didn't take their chances, they created plenty of opportunities. What a fantastic occasion for Dublin. Back to back, All Ireland is something special. My man of the match today was Michael Fitzsimons. I thought he was excellent. Uh, introduced today, he was outstanding. He defended brilliantly, attacked brilliantly. Player of the season, Brian Fenton of Dublin. I thought he was outstanding. A young player, managed the game brilliantly. A huge game against Kerry, a huge game against Mayo in the drawn match and outstanding all year. Off doing this on the game now, so chat later.